So in this video, we are going to use OBS as a virtual camera in an online meeting, maybe a virtual meeting. So the first thing you need to do is go to your OBS, open it up, and then you create your scene. For example, in my scene, I want to maybe have uh, my desktop streaming to them. Maybe audio capture, display capture, anything that you want. You can add or remove anything, or you can even create several scenes. We did that in a video a while back. You'll get a card somewhere here. You can click on it and learn how to create our sources and uh, compose our scene. So right now, we want to use just this scene as is because you don't want to waste a lot of time what you need to do is to just click on a start virtual camera now that it's running you can go to your virtual meeting click on allow yes allow so this is my webcam I don't want my webcam I want something else I can click on these three dots go to settings and uh, for our microphone we can change however way we want, but we're interested in our video. Once you click on uh, this camera option, you can change this to OBS virtual camera because it's running. Remember, we clicked on a uh, start virtual camera in OBS, so it's now running. So once we click on OBS, what will happen is it will stream our desktop all the way up to our virtual meeting. So we go back here, you can see. Let me let me go and grab something let's just put it somewhere aside let me resize it so that we get a playing ground so as you can see anything that we are doing is being recorded by obs and obs is channeling this all the way to our google meeting you can use this for zoom you can also use this for teams i believe I'll try that and I'll put that in the comment region, but I definitely this will work. So this is how you go about it. So if you want to stop, you click on just stop and uh, you get this background here. If you want to go back to maybe your webcam, go to settings and uh, go to video, but your camera, now you click on the camera that you're using at that moment. So I think that's easy enough. Okay. Thank you for watching the, this quick one, quick tutorial. I hope you'll find it useful.